Hey Libras and welcome to my channel. I am here doing your weekly love reading for um, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Uh, the first card out will be your overall energy of the reading. And I am using the Romance Angels to get that card. All right. The card that came out for you is you deserve love. So um, you are lovable. It's time to take um, back your power. You could be dealing with the Sagittarius. This card always reminds me of the Sagittarius with the bow and arrow. But um, Cupid is coming for you is, is what I'm hearing. So let's get three cards for you, Libra. Let's get three cards. All right, your first card out is the Nine of Swords in Reverse. Awesome. No longer living in your head, no longer um, feeling depressed, anxious, overwhelmed. Um, you're just letting it go. You realize that you deserve more than this and uh, you are moving forward to that. The next card out is the Queen of Wands. So you're feeling very confident. Um, this person that you um, are trying to get over really uh, had an effect on your self-esteem, really um, made you feel insecure, but you're taking that power back. You're feeling uh, very stable, very loving. People are just drawn to you. Yeah, because you're getting over the loss. You're getting over the, um, the lack of the relationship you had with somebody else. You're uh, realizing that the cups may have spilled over, but you still got two in your hand and you're going forward. You're moving forward and just really um, looking at life in a whole new way. The person that you are dealing with, ooh, the first card out for them is the Six of Pentacles. So um, they're going to offer you a, a more fair and balanced um, situation. They have a, oh, nice. Okay. Um, there could have been more than one person in the past, but not necessarily. Uh, the imbalance of energy could simply be between they spent too much time at work and not enough time home, or they spent a lot of time with their friends and, and not with you. Um, it's just an imbalance of energy, giving to one area of your life more than the other. Um, they are going to go through a time of healing, a time of reflection, and a time of pause. But when they come out of this uh, Four of Swords, they're going to passionately want to move forward with you. The bottom of your deck is also the Ace of Swords. Amazing. A new beginning based on truth, clarity. After they come out of this Hermit, you could be dealing with a Virgo as well. So uh, heavy uh, pinnacle energy, heavy earth energy there at the bottom of the deck. <clears throat> so, um, let's get some clarifiers here for you, Libra. Why is the Nine of Swords here? Way too many. Why is the Nine of Swords here for Libra? What do they need to know about the Nine of Swords? <laughs> the Ace of Swords. So, uh, you're, you're coming out of this time of of sadness, out of, of being in your head too much, out of all the worry, because the truth is being given to you. The divine is shining down the sword of truth, and it's going to allow you to get control of your feelings, your thoughts, your ideas, and you're no longer going to be worried about it because, because the cloud of confusion is gone. And you know, the King of Pentacles wanted to flip there, but it didn't. Um, you know that you are, you have a reason to be confident. You know that um, what you got is what they want. And you're, you've done a beautiful job healing. You have brought in a lot of self-healing. You have really worked hard to get back to this amazing status, this amazing place of um, happiness, contentment. Um, this is also Archangel Michael blessing your love life. So, uh, just be a little bit more patient. Know that you deserve this. For some reason, Libra, you guys are feeling like you um, don't deserve this person. You're getting over some heartache of the past, some hurt. Um, someone left you out in the cold. Someone abandoned you. Somebody um, could have put you in a financial struggle, a bind. But you're coming out of both those. Uh, you are moving forward in a beautiful new healing way. 
Um, a, a Sagittarius could have been could have brought this healing to you. Um, I have three cards of Sagittarius here. So um, all in your reading. If if you're not dealing with a Saggy, this is in your chart heavily. Um, but you're getting out of that feeling of being neglected, of being taken advantage of, of being left out in the cold. Because you know that your true soulmate is coming for you. You know your true soulmate is coming back for you. Um, and you're letting all that go. Which is amazing energy, Libra. Alright, why does Libra's person have this Six of Pentacles? What do they need to know about this card? Thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Don't have to say much more. The Ace of Swords underneath the Ace of or the Ace of Cups underneath the Ace of Swords, both of you are ready for a new beginning. They're coming back more balanced. They're coming back and going to offer you this new emotional um, level of maturity. They're no longer going to spend more time with their friends than you. They're no longer going to put their work in front of the family. Um, they're <clears throat> following their heart, and they're going to offer this love to you. And that's why you're no longer stressed out, because... You, they came and spoke their truth. They came and spoke their true feelings to you. And you're no longer um, worried about them leaving. They love you. And they have the Ace of Wands, Ace of Cups, and you have the Ace of Swords and Temperance. This is a beautiful connection. You deserve this. Why is it four? Whoa. <laughs> All right, the Four of Swords. They um, got out of a situation where they felt like they were trapped. Um, they cut their losses and walked away. They could have left um, belongings, possessions, money. Um, they just walked away. They up and left. Now they're healing so that they can come forward towards you and offer you this beautiful, passionate new beginning, a new life to create with each other. King of Cups. They love you. If there's any question about the love that they feel for you, there should be no question. There is no reason for you to worry. There is no reason for you to um, fear this person uh, not coming back or not being enough for this. This person caused some heartache in the past. There was a third party here um, for some of you, not all of you. But um, if there was, you knew about it because you're healed from that. You both have found healing and love and um, you're, you're starting to take action. Or the person is, whoever is the one that is uh, needing to uh, take action in order for this relationship to come to fruition, it's being done now. Because they took the time to heal. They took the time to get over this Three of Swords. You also took the time to get out of this Five of Pentacles, Five of Cups situation. And it's now coming all into balance. Um, this is a Twin Flame Soulmate situation. So Archangel Michael is blessing your guys' uh, connection together. Okay, so you had two that flipped, the fire prince. Can I say fire sign again? This is crazy. Stay optimistic. There's uh, no reason to doubt about this person's true, genuine feelings for you. Um, stay optimistic, but um, stay strong on your course. Stay um, in the path and make sure your intentions are known by the universe on what you want out of this relationship. The second card that flipped was the Sisters of the Seasons. Cycles of growth, natural law, and divine order. Everything has to happen in its own order, in its own right. So we can't rush it. We can't um, can't make it go any faster. So just um, take the time to enjoy yourself, um, to work on yourself, and to know that they are coming back for you. It's just, it just has to take the natural course of progression. But don't worry. You do deserve this. It's coming for you soon. And um, boy, it's going to knock you off your feet. So how exciting for you, Libras. This is an amazing... Um, energy, amazing, amazing reading. You have come out of some hard times, some hard, um, troubled relationship issues, but you have ended so many cycles right now and you are on the path to new beginnings with somebody who has unconditional love for you. Somebody who is ready to face the world and, and have you by his side. And so remain confident Remain, have that self-esteem, that self-assurance that you are everything this person wants and that this is blessed and guided by the divine. So Libras, I hope you guys have a great couple of weeks. Once again, thank you for joining me on my channel. I love you all and God bless.